Good morning, this is Brad from the beach and uh, this morning I'm excited to share with you a, a passage of scripture that has spoken to my life over all the years that I've known and, and done my best to try to serve the Lord. It comes out of Philippians chapter 3 beginning with verse 12. Not that I have already obtained this or am already perfect, but I press on to make it my own because Christ Jesus has made me his own. Brothers, I do not consider that I have made it my own, but one thing I do, forgetting what lies behind and straining forward to what lies ahead, I press on toward the goal for the prize of the upward call of God in Christ Jesus. You know, one of the things that the enemy tries to, to get us focused on is our failures or the struggles we're going through the things that the enemy would use to really bind us up. I had a pastor friend not long ago. Uh, he had passed away and they showed a clip from his uh, message that he had done shortly before he passed away. Uh, and in that message, he simply says, and I need you to hang with me on this. He said, what can be never will be until we let go of what could have been. The truth of the matter is we often get bound up to what was, what our failures were, the things we didn't get done. And, and God wants us to step in to what he's planned for us, what can be in Christ Jesus. And so our job really is to lay hold of him because he's laid hold of us, but he's also laid hold of our future. He's laid hold of the plans for us. And so we want to press into Jesus so that we don't, get hung and and somehow defeated or debilitated by what the past was but we get a picture of what god wants for us in christ jesus and we want to step into him and press into him so we can press into what he has for us the enemy's great design and desire is to see us give up and quit and come down to the place where we feel like we're not worthy truth of the matter is none of us are worthy but we've been made worthy through the blood of the Lamb. Jesus died for you and me and established our value in His shed blood. So here's the deal, guys. There's stuff out here that can be for us in God, but it can really be ours if we will let go of the things that have held us back and then lay hold of Christ Jesus and in Him find victory and have the past redeemed through his blood. And then we can step into all of the things that God has prepared for us. What we've dreamed in him can be. What he's died for us to experience can be. What he's planned for us can be. But we need to be willing to let go of what could have been so we can walk in all that he has planned for us. Press in, press forward, and lay hold of the prize. His name is Jesus. This has been bread from the beach. Be blessed in Jesus' name.